Hi folks, this is E.T. Prepper. This is a little clip from J.D. Farrig, and uh, he's a preacher in Hawaii, actually. But he gives a uh, Bible prophecy update, and this is from September 9th. And it's regarding the red heifer that was just born. Pay attention, because I'll tell you what, things are really accelerating. It should be noted that this ultimate peace deal is just one part of the puzzle prophetically. Uh, if you haven't subscribed to me, subscribe and also please share this. This is important information that needs to get out there to other people. The peace deal will pave the way for the Jews rebuilding the temple, which can happen, and I'm going to use that word again, very quickly. <laughs> very quickly, especially now that according to a breaking Israel news report, the Temple Institute is announcing the birth of a red heifer. Now some of you are going, a what? Okay, just bear with me on this. So um, the Jews, keep in mind, they're still waiting for their Messiah. They rejected the true Messiah, which they will uh, embrace at the end of the seven year tribulation, when the whole house of Israel is saved. Now, they're waiting for their Messiah and they cannot conduct the purification ceremonies in the newly rebuilt temple absent the ashes of a red heifer. This was part of the ceremonial purification and cleansing from their sins that they need. So this red heifer, and there have been many red heifers, but the problem is the red heifer has to be perfectly red, cannot have any black or white or any other color in it. It has to be a pure red heifer, as we're going to talk about, without any spot, any blemish, anything at all. It has to be perfect and red. What's different this time? Okay, I mean, there's been red heifers over the years that... Uh, qualified until they, uh, you know, showed up with a, a blemish or a spot. W what's different this time? Oh, what's different this time is Russia, Iran, Turkey are in Syria. Damascus is on the cusp of becoming a ruinous heap. A peace deal that was heretofore unreachable seems more plausible today than it ever has. The rebuilding of the temple is... I mean, at the ready, as far as the Jews are concerned. And now, this last week, the Temple Institute certifies this red heifer. Listen, I'm not a, certainly not a mathematician, but um, can I ask what are the statistical odds of all of those factors converging simultaneously for such a time as this?